and the activity was to create an interactive word wall based on vocabulary that we'd been studying in class. So when giving the assignment, I came in and created 12 sections on the wall. And then they were asked to include the following things in their section. They had to have the definition of the word, um, a 3D something that was representative of that word, um, a couple pictures, a QR code that leads to a video or alternate explanation of the term, um, and any other keywords. So on some of the words um, that we're not as familiar with in the definition, it might have four words that we also don't know, and so they needed to include those definitions as well. I think that, that their section being next to other students' sections is a, a little more pressure, so it's not just the teacher who's going to see it and look at it, it's everyone else, and so the, the drive to make it, make it a little bit more spectacular is, is definitely there. Um, sometimes I think thinking outside of the box is a little challenging for students. You know, technology is a key part of students' lives. And I think it's important to embrace the things that you all are familiar and comfortable with and show you ways that we can use those educationally and not just for social media um, or things like that. So we can take that technology and we can incorporate it meaningfully into, into class. <laughs>